Well, good morning, everybody. Apologize for missing a, a video yesterday. Uh, I did make it to Port Alberni. I'm here right now. There's a lineup to get into McDonald's, so here right now I figured I'd do a little video before I go get my coffee and head back to my friends. So I think today will be the last day. Uh, two things have happened since uh, last time we spoke. I did pick up my solar panels from Shimanus, BC, and uh, we go solar. I was able to put them up yesterday with the uh, help of my friend, Sean. Actually, he did a lot of the, he, well, he did all the climbing, actually. Uh, you know, and that really helped me out a lot. Uh, it's not a permanent fix. I did, well, the reason I say that, because I, I think I put them up right. Uh, I, like my power supply is right behind my head. So I think I, I put the wire portion up towards here. So, but if not, you can take them off and th that might have to happen. Uh, so yeah, so we were able to get that that down. Um, we used zap straps to do that. So I didn't have to drill any holes or do anything else. My, my, um, my roof rack is round, so you can drill into it, obviously, but uh, it looks like it's heavy enough steel that it's going to take some effort. So I want to make sure everything is together. If we have to lift it off, zap straps or nothing. You can snap them, replace them, but they'll hold. I took a drive yesterday. Uh, everything seemed to be fine. Uh, they didn't make any whistling noises. Uh, and the back end didn't lift up a little bit, which I thought it might, because there was about uh, maybe an inch and a half, two inch overhang on the back part. Uh, and I put them on the back, my fault, I'm bad. Eek. Uh, I thought they would go like sideways. And I guess it would, it's just I would have had to cut my, cut my roof rack a little bit and I'd have to, uh, you know, make it so it would fit. I tried to bend the bars and they were, they were a little bit too heavy to bend. So anyways, I decided that, you know what? I can live with a little roof rack up here. Like I don't want something heavy duty. Like I don't want something so I'm gonna put like 50,000 pounds up above me here, no. It's just like, you know, an extra bag or a chair instead of wrapping it up and, you know, just throw it up top, tie it down, and we're good to go. That's all it's for, it's just, you know, or if I want to put a cooler up there, if I'm just moving down the road a bit or something, you know, just something like that. It's, it's not it's not meant for heavy duty because everything I own is back here, put away, and we're good with that. But uh, yeah, it, it was a little bit, uh, you know, but it looks all right. I mean, I put some pictures on Instagram. I mean, it look, it's looking pretty good. I, I haven't clipped off the, the zap strap lines yet because, uh, you know, I might not be finished with them, but I want to wait until it's all said and done, and then I can snap them off where they need to be snapped off, so it doesn't look, you know, doesn't look unfinished. And uh, yeah, because I don't know what's going to happen yet. But it's just up there; it's not hooked up. It's just for traveling purposes only, so I can get back to uh, Vancouver. And uh, Joseph said he'll take a look at it. So. We're gonna figure that out today. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I think I'm going to attempt to take off my bumper. Uh, I have a new bumper in Vancouver. Uh, well, it's not like brand new, but it's newer than the one, uh, one I have on here now, and it doesn't have a big ding in it. So, just little, you know, and I'm gonna meet up with my other friend, Mark, who uh, called me last night and uh, you know whenever I'm done here we're gonna hook up and uh, he's gonna help me paint paint this van or paint part of it or whatever I think we're just gonna like I love to get a matching semi matching color for this van I like to keep it blue and I just like to get away the gray blemishes uh, you know it'll take a little bit of sanding and stuff and since he already knows what he's doing I mean 
I'll help out as much as I can, whatever, you know, I don't mind. Uh, but yeah, and hopefully that'll come together. So for all you people out there that are wondering if I'm going to get a full plane job, well, the answer is no. Uh, and I will get rid of the blue bl or the gray blemishes because I never really thought of it, but it's a good idea. So yeah, I like to have it one color. It'd be great. It, it would be great. But it ain't going to make me go down the road any quicker, and it ain't going to make me not go into the bush any sooner. Uh, so, but it will look pretty. And uh, that will be great. Uh, yeah, I haven't done any really uh, off-roading, like, you know, off-roading, go off main main thing, uh, main main highway. But uh, Dick... Uh, <laughs> Dick, oh, sorry. <laughs> I dipped into towns, and uh, yeah, and that's the funny thing, man. Coming from the city, I keep on looking to see what time it is because, you know, not not that anybody said anything bad or nothing. It's just they said, oh, keep it down to maybe maybe eight minutes. So I'm trying to. I don't want to go on and on because I can't talk. But anyways, coming from big cities, man, these little towns. The streets roll up at about 6 o'clock. After 6, you can hardly find anything open. I find that a little bit. It's entertaining and uh, it's like, wow. So if you're going to get anything done, you better get it done before the sun goes down. Uh, because after that, you're in the dark. Which is great. Like, I mean, there's some things about the way they, they used to do it years ago. I still find appealing. You know, but uh, yeah, it, it's something I have to get used to, but it's nice, quiet, you know, and, uh, yeah, I'm not sure where, where else I go from there, but, yeah, I just wanted to, uh, check in, touch base, uh, oh, yeah, today, I think, if I'm leaving today, I'm gonna go to, uh, I think it's called Coombs or Combs or something like that, I wanna see some goats pooping on the roof, <laughs> no, <laughs> actually, if you, Watch Chrome's video. Some guy gave us a bag of popcorn from Coombs or the goat's poop. And that's where I'm heading. <laughs> I gotta grab myself a bag or two. Uh, that, that popcorn was good. Guaranteed. Anyways, yeah, I'm just gonna, you know, move around. Uh, yeah. And I'm not sure, but I'm gonna stay out here for a few days. Probably be back on the weekend because I have to hook up with my friend Mark. Uh, he wants to get together, and which is good. I want to get together too and uh, get this paint thing going if we can. And eventually, whenever uh, Joseph has time, it doesn't matter, you know, sooner or later. I'm all right with what I got right now. I got my solar, so you, the fact that it's there, it's great. And uh, again, one more shout out again for the people at uh, We Go Solar. You know, they're very helpful. And I keep on forgetting her name. And I apologize. I forget a lot of names lately, and that concerns me. And I talked to the doctor, but he he doesn't say it's a problem. But I don't know if it's because of the thing I'm going into or my life right now. It's a little bit shaky. I'm not sure. Um, but yes, anyways, I know who she is. So she was very lovely and nice and... Uh, yeah, send me some pictures, and uh, yeah. So if you're ever if you're ever driving by Shamanus and you need you need something about solar, I don't have the links. I'm not set up like Chrome is, but uh, you can find the links. It's on uh, just Google it, like they tell me, and I found them. And uh, yeah, they'll be more than uh, happy to give you a hand. Anyways, okay. Take care. I love yous. Just a short message. I'll try to get another one. I might even do one later on today. Who knows? But, you know, I'm not... I'm, I'm just... Because this is fairly easy sometimes. Like, yesterday, it wasn't so easy because I couldn't... I wasn't by myself and there was people all around me. So, anyways, I'm trying to keep it. I'm a little bit over eight. Now I'm nine now. So, anyways, it's been fun talking to you. And I'm really glad, I, I, as I see my uh, subscriptions go, or whatever it is, uh, yeah, everybody's coming over, a lot of people are, yeah, and I, my, my numbers are climbing, you know, 
so yeah i'm happy about all that and, and if it's not if it wasn't because of you guys support me and i do know there's a few people in the audience there that uh have my back so if anybody just wants to you know talk crap be careful there's a few sharks out there that'll snip you well, I read some of their comments, like in reply to somebody else, which I never seen the other comments, but I read their comments, and yeah, man, I got a posse behind me. Be careful. <laughs> Tread lightly. <laughs> I love you all. I don't care. Speak what you want to say. Say what you want to say. I don't care. That's all right. Okay. Have a good time. Safe travels. Be safe. And I'll see you next time. Thank you.